Hello job seekers, Melanie here with CGL Recruiting. And today we're gonna to be talking about how you can add bullets and all those little emojis to your LinkedIn profile. There is a right way and there is a way that's a little bit more dangerous. So let's go in and talk about both of them. Now, if you haven't subscribed yet, please consider doing that now. Please give us that thumbs up if you feel like this data is helpful. And as always, feel free to connect with me on LinkedIn and share this with other job seekers. Okay, so there are two ways that you can do this when you're looking at your LinkedIn profile. And remember, you do have recruiter fatigue that is gonna stop people from reading all the different sections on your profile. So the longer you can keep them interested in it, the better chance you have of them getting attached to you as a candidate. And you can also really use these methods to pull your recruiter's eyes down through your profile so they get further and further in. Too many of them can be overwhelming, so please make sure you're using an appropriate amount. But let's talk about how you can actually add those to your profile. Okay, job seekers. So the first way to add bullets is actually a LinkedIn approved way. You may not know this because it's not out there very much. LinkedIn does give you the chance to enter bullets into your profile. So how do you do that? Well, all you have to do is go onto your profile wherever you wanna add the bullets and go into edit mode. And don't worry, I'm gonna show you this live in just a second, but I do wanna talk it through first. And what you do is you click on that little edit blue pencil. And then on your keyboard, you want to press down the alt key and then there's a code. And that code is 0149. And then you release the alt key and a bullet appears. Let's show you that now. So if you go to the main home page and you go under the me symbol and you go into view your profile, just go to the section of your profile where you wanna add the bullets. Now in this case, I'm gonna go under my about section and all I have to do is go to the blue pencil on the right, click on that and go down to the area where I wanna add the bullets. So you can see I have this little section here that says bullet testing. All I need to do is put my cursor right to the left of the text where I wanna do the bullet, hold down that Alt key, type in 0149 and release the Alt key. And there you can see that bullet is right there in front of the text. Now I can add a couple extra spaces if I want it to be away from it, but I do wanna make sure you know that when you're doing it, it does not show you the numbers that you're typing. So again, those type, the numbers you need to type is 0149 and just hit release and that's where that little bullet goes. And then when I click save, you're gonna actually see that information down below, right where I put in those two bullets. Now for this LinkedIn approved bullet, there are a couple of things you need to know. And that is one, these when you are actually printing off or saving a profile to PDF show up and they look exactly like they look on your profile. So that is great news because it doesn't make it all look funky or it doesn't make them disappear. But you can only utilize this if you have a separate numeric keyboard on your keyboard or if you have numeric lock on your keyboard in which you can put that on first and then press down the Alt key and then type in those numbers and release the Alt key. And that will do it for you for certain. But there is a second way to do it because some of you want more than just a standard bullet. <laughs> you want something that is flashy or that you can change colors on or different things. And there are lots of different systems out on the web where you can find these copy them and paste them exactly into your profile. Now I wanna warn you, I'm gonna show you one of these, but you do have to be careful with these because when you do it, if it turns out that it's a text, a Unicode text that LinkedIn doesn't recognize, it makes it disappear when it goes to change your profile to a PDF or when somebody takes your profile and uploads it. And you can test that some, and I'm gonna show you how to do that too. So let's go into LinkedIn and I'll show you how to do that right now. Okay, let's take a look at how you can add those bullets that have more different colors and shapes and all kinds of fun things. 
So this is one text generator that I use when I'm trying to convert things to Unicode. Now we did do a video on if you're looking to do things like change your text into like bold, please watch that whole video. If you do this, it can actually hurt your job search. So don't go doing this until you know what you're doing. But what you will also see on this fancy text generator, which I will actually put a link to in the description, is down below it has other ways in order for you to get those different emojis and different text. Now the generator that I just showed you to do this, I will make sure and link to this in the description. It is only one, I'm not being sponsored by them or anything, it's just one of the ones that is available out there for you should you want to use it. But make sure that you test it. Make sure you know how your profile is gonna look by just doing that save to PDF and it'll show you which ones show up and which ones do not. As always, I hope this information was helpful, job seekers. If you have other great ways that you found ones to do this, Put it in a comment down below if there's one that you like using more than the one that I've shown you. I always like to learn more about LinkedIn and I know everybody else does as well. Thanks again and I will see you next time.